purpose of this video is to show you how the material browser and the material editor works in Inventor 2014. Once you open up the material browser, the first thing you'll see is the a list of all the materials that exist in your default material library. In this case, it's the Inventor material library, and to see the categories, you just expand, uh, expand these folders out here. The first button that's going to come in handy for using materials from this library is adding add material to document. From there, you'll then be able to use the edit material button here which opens up the material editor. Within this dialog there are three individual tabs, the identity, so information that relates to the product itself or, and the description of the material, the um, details of the appearance for this material and then the physical properties as well. Um, so appearance and physical um, tabs are both assets which exist in separate um, browsers. Within the appearance tab this drop down button here allows you to select the the shape and type of the thumbnail but it also gives you some options for rendering quality down here in addition you have the ability to change the um, the image type so it does you know display the, diff the diffuse color map of the material you can either choose a preset or an image over in the physical tab um, expand these areas out here to be able to so you can fill in all of the um, known physical properties of the material but as on the appearance tab here you have this replace asset button clicking on that will open up the asset browser for that particular asset type in this case it's a physical asset and then you can um, select the um, physical asset that you want to use and click the replace button here and it will replace the um, the data in these cells You're also able to toggle the asset browser on and off using this button down here, and depending on the um, which tab you're on, it will change the um, switch between the appearance and physical asset browser. Coming back into the material browser itself, you also have the um, this button down here to create a brand new material um, should you not find what you need in the default libraries.